Hello there, K-Ball here from Zurb, and now we're going to talk about Interchange and the Interchange plugin. Interchange is a tool that you can use to responsively display different content, uh, often different images based on screen size. And that uh, lets you do things like optimize for different screen sizes, conserve bandwidth, not load things. Um, so at its core, the basic uh, Interchange with an image lets you show uh, one image, per breakpoint that you choose. So we're here showing a large image. As our screen resizes down, it switches over to a medium image, a small image. Uh, those could actually be totally different images or they could just be different levels of optimization, different aspect ratios, things like that. What this ends up looking like is instead of a source tag for the image, we use a data interchange attribute that contains a list of our pairs. So, you know, where it is that the image lives. This is what would go into the source uh, tag paired with what breakpoint it should show on. Uh, and this behaves differently than, for example, having multiple images that you show in hide by size because this will only load the one that's appropriate for that screen size. <clears throat> These media queries here can be any of the foundation named media queries, um, or they can just be you know random CSS media queries, however you want. Um, you can also use this to swap in entire chunks of HTML. So for example, on a large screen, you might want an interactive map. This map you know, is you're just a Google embed, but on a smaller screen, that's, that can be a little awkward. You might want to have an image that links to a map instead. So you can use interchange to do that. I swap in this image, can have it link off to a map, what have you. You do this by having a div tag or other non-image tag uh, with the data interchange and then pointing to different partials. And those partials are going to be loaded the same way that the images were loaded when you did this on an image um, based on breakpoint and loaded into the correct place. Uh, if you use images rather than HTML, you can actually set the uh, background image on a, a div tag and all of that. Um, the media queries supported by default in your breakpoints variable in SAS, or if you're using the uh, CSS version, um, just what ships in your standard CSS version are these. So you have small, medium, large, extra large, extra, extra large. You also get a portrait landscape, uh, retina, which is this fun, fancy media query. Um, and you can actually create your own named media queries for interchange if you choose to, uh, simply by setting this variable. Um, like all of our JavaScript components, JavaScript or Interchange is accessible by JavaScript. You can pass those rules in. Um, and it does fire events as things happen. So when it replaces, uh, it will fire this replaced event, and you can programmatically replace paths. And that is the Interchange component.